Well, we're at 7,800 feet and uh, we hit more snow and that is not passable. So I am going to hike up to the ridge up there and uh, see what I can see, go from there. Should be a good time. So I'm heading out, it's about six o'clock. It's beautiful. And I'm heading up there. Okay, I just heard something grunt. Yeah, that was my stomach. I think I'll get up here on the ridge, set up, and scope it out. This guy doesn't even know I'm here. Hey, Doe, I'm up here behind you. Silly does. So I couldn't figure out why that doe was so nervous. That turns out there's a bear. Down in there somewhere. So I'm gonna hang out, make sure it doesn't have any cubs. And if I don't see any cubs, I'm gonna try to shoot a bear. There's that doe again, and she knows where that bear is. Can you tell I'm shaking? Yep, got a little adrenaline going here. So I know the bear is still in there. I just need to maybe wait him out. We'll see. Can you see him anywhere? That deer is coming right up here towards me now. Where's the bear? Alright, so I'm fairly sure the bear is down in there. Uh, I got the wind with me at this point, so I'm going to circle around the left hand side and see if I can't come up and get a different angle or a different view, see if I can see him through the trees uh, and hope that he doesn't escape out the back while I'm doing that. Wish me luck. This doe is so crazy. It did a complete circle for a second time around that patch of timber. I don't know why it's circling that bear, but... See ya. Well, um, I snuck down a little ways and saw him through the trees. He was bedded down and uh, scoped him for a while. Didn't see any cubs. And um, he stood up like he was going to start walking off, so I, I went ahead and took a shot. I think it was a really good shot. Um, uh, I'm really not sure. I'm going to kind of circle around uh, and go in from the side so that if he's running out the bottom, um, I'll be able to see him. Uh, exciting. And that's the ant pile that I laid in to take the shot. Good job. So I'm pretty sure I got him up in there. All right, that's where I shot at him. I see a little bit of that snow pushed up like someone, something's run through it. So I don't know, it doesn't look good. 
Let's see what else I can see here. I don't want to walk up there just yet. Call it a healthy respect. <laughs> By the way, the, the bear was a cinnamon color, so I'm anxious to see. Uh, anxious to see it. Hopefully I got it. Guess what that is? That right there is Rob's first bear. I would say that I shot him. <laughs> Yay, Rob. Sure doesn't look very big from here. June 2nd, 2013, got my first bear, um, pretty excited, um, gonna take a few pictures and then I'm gonna gut it up and strap it onto my new pack, well, as much as I can, and uh, get it out of here. I got plenty of daylight, so I'm gonna try to take it out whole, um, yeah, we'll see. Doesn't look very big, um, but kind of funny. It smells like a dog. I don't know. Uh, looks like a boar. Um, pretty excited. So I got it all cut up and skinned, and I'm going to um, take the hide out first, hang up the meat, and come back for a second trip and get the, uh, the meat. <laughs> 